This is the Real Eyes Recognized Podcast. Now your hosts, Dustin Gutkowski and UFC fighter. Uh, what are you doing? doing? What's up, brother? Terrence is going to be joining us on the Real Eyes Recognized Podcast from here on out when he can, oh, man. No it's going to be good times. Hell yeah, brother. That's the showstopper right there, man. Yeah. Mr. Like four seconds. I forget. How, how fast is your knockout, bro? Uh, we all know deep down it was four seconds. They didn't want me to break the record this soon. But yeah, it was seven seconds. Yeah, we all know. <laughs> so how, what's yeah. going on today, man? Where are you at? You in Ohio? Yeah, I'm in Cleveland, brother. The 440, brother. How's that's everything with you, Dustin, man? Man, we're living the dream out here in Texas. Uh, we are hot. We are cooking. Uh, it's 112. Uh, and uh, we're no, we're not bringing four friends. That's just the degrees, but it is hot. And uh, we had... Uh, uh it was cooking bro it was, it, but it's good man we're blessed hell yeah brother you know it man every day we wake up is a blessing absolutely so yeah man like i said we're gonna get this kevin's on his way uh we're gonna have t-rex man we're gonna bring on t-rex to the squad when he can get this thing going and That's uh cool. yeah man so what else is going on with you man like i got the question is how do you get into power slap bro like how does that even happen man um so look the normal people, man, you can get into Power Slap by going to powerslap.com, you know, filling out a survey, you know, uh, posting up some videos, giving them some pictures and some background and seeing if, you know, if, if, if they like what they see, uh, especially if you have experience, you know, the better. Uh, but for me, it was, uh, it was kind of uh, peculiar because I actually had a friend who was a friend of the guy who made The Ultimate Fighter. And he just somehow randomly said to my friend, hey, I'm trying to make a, a slap fighting promotion with Dana White. And it just so happened that I was trying to join um, Slap Fight Championship. And he knew that. And he was like, I got a guy for you, man. He's perfect. He's like WWE. And he's like brutal and all in one. You know, he's perfect for this shit. So uh, I got a call from Gary DeFranco from the UFC. He said, hey, man, I got something going on. You want to join? And I said, fuck yeah, let's rock. Bro, like, I mean, I figure I just like power slap, though. That's different. Like, what do you even, man? I don't, I don't know. When's the next event? I got a quote. Like, what do you even wear what, to a power what, slap what, event? What, bro, what's your what's training regimen? Like, what, how do you train for this? Is it um, your girlfriend help you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, when she gets out of line? <laughs> no, man. Uh, you know, what, what I do is uh, I basically do it all, brother. You know, I, I lift weights. Uh, two muscle groups a day, you know, steaks and weights, I like to call it because I'm always and weights. Protein. Yeah, brother, you know, getting it, getting that fill in. Um, but just going to the gym, hit it hard. And, uh, you know, I um, sometimes train at Strong Style, which is uh, Stipe, Stipe Miocic's, uh gym and uh, Alexa Kamer and John Hawk, a lot of badass motherfuckers from that gym. And I go there and, and get beat up sometimes, too. So, yeah. Um, that's always a good time, but it, it's it, it like you know MMA training, man. MMA training is probably the most brutal in the world. You know, if you can do that, you know, you probably can do power slap. Yo, did I see you hitting the uh, when the, what is it the the bag the other day the 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 punching machine? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. What'd you slap yeah, just, that thing? Um, that was just at a local bar. They want some B roll for uh, the show, the road to the title, and I I was like, I'll just go to the punch machine and slap the shit out of that thing, man. Got a 900, you know. 900 slap. on a slap. Damn, bro. Shit. Yeah, bro. Hey, man, you're talking to the number one power, number one speed in the league right now, brother. I'm hitting with force. That's what I'm talking about, bro. He's a yeah, that's that's King Phillips. You better put some respect on my guy's you, you, name You in right the finals there. or what? You in the the finals? King, baby. So what So what was the – so for people that don't know, what was the journey, though? You had – you got injured, right? You were on the show, was it – and you got injured. And can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah, man. So uh, two days before my fight with Dwayne the Iron Giant Crespo, um, I got injured, man. Uh, me and the Bell, we were talking shit to each other pretty much all season. You know, he was one of the top ranked heavyweights. Uh, honestly, I was number one on the show, but they just put these guys in over me. But we all know who the champ is here. Um, but we were talking shit. <laughs> we went to the, the dummy, you know, we were throwing uh, slaps at the dummy. And he's like, man, I can knock that dummy to the ground. I'm like, sure, you can't. So he slapped it, knocked it to the ground. I knew he could. He's a big dude, man. He's the champ. And uh, I was like, you know what? I'll do it. I'll, I'll knock it to the ground. Watch this. So uh, we, we started talking, and uh, 
the one of the guys in the the facility lifted it up, put it back up, and he was like, "Oh man, we gotta weigh this down." So he put two fifty pound vests on the legs of the the boss system. You know, the boss oh, system with shit. the head. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So so then it was my time to crank and and hit it. So I whammied it, but it had an extra hundred pounds on it. I launched that shit, blew my bicep straight up. The bicep rolled right into my shoulder, man. Uh, it was a sharp pain. Oh. I was like, ooh. I was like, oh man. And I, I looked at it, I was like, oh God, it was like it was gone. And uh yeah, two days before the fight, but they're telling me not to fight. I said, you know what? We gotta put on a show. Uh my fight was the very last fight of the season, so I felt like I was the main event, uh, which was the second main event that I did for Power Slap. So I was like, you know, the show must go on, man. I'm going in with my left. Let's give it a shot. Let's see what we can do, you know. I was like, I'll, I'll eat this motherfucker shots every day of the week like a sandwich, brother. I, I, I'm not even afraid of Dwayne the Iron Giant <laughs> Crespo. <laughs> Slides, bro. Cry, cry baby Crespo. That's what I was calling him throughout the house. Uh, so, you know, I wasn't scared. And, you know, I did my thing. And, unfortunately, uh, I didn't get the win. But uh, I think I got the respect. So so are you full? Is it fully healed now? Yep. R- ready to go, brother. Two weeks ago, got the news that we're ready to train. And I've been hitting it hard. Kill. When, when, when's, when's the next fight uh the next card is october 25th and i'm trying to make that i can't say 100 percent if i'm going to or not because i'm still under doctor's orders with uh physical therapy and stuff he wants me to complete that but uh it's looking like that's going to be the return though october 25th you gotta let or, us know me t-rex and kevin yeah, come out i've been one to go to a Dude, show bad yeah man. you come on out buddy i know you got you isn't uh aren't you boys with chris thomas the uh middleweight champ yeah, he walked yeah, out yeah. with him. Yeah. yeah, you should definitely come out because that's that, that's his return date too. Oh, it is. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to step out, man. Bro, that's gonna be legendary. The 25th. What do you wear at an event like that, bro? What's what's? The, I don't even know the dress code. You go I, to. I feel like line. everyone always wear like t-shirts and stuff. Yeah. Everyone be super casual, bro. Dustin, you better wear like the pinkest like suit, <laughs> like three piece with bro. the white. Dapper it up, come on. He in, gonna shoot fucking shit, blazing, bro. Down come the- out, just <laughs> fucking blazing, bro. Letting them know what fucking time it is, yo. No. Seriously, yeah. Bro, I, yes, bro. We used to be on that bang bang back in the day, bro. I feel like I could go on slap lead. Remember you that rock paper scissors, and then you pop on the arm, bro. We bring that man. One kid though, we got in serious trouble. That motherfucker, hey, bro, you like busted up in his arm, and he we didn't know back in the day it was like a blood vessel. We were like plotting like. And he's gonna die. Don't go to the no. nurse. You can't snitch. But we were on that. I was like, damn, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember uh-huh. those days, man. Those like those what do we call them? Like the wild willies or something. I yeah, dude. This shit was yeah. Good. I'm playing was... quarters. I'm good. No yeah, thanks. Yeah, but that's what <laughs> I seen him do that. I was like, well, I ain't doing that, man. I'm sorry. So who do you want, man? <laughs> who 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 who's on the hit list? So obviously you got injured. That sucks. Coming back. Uh, who's on the hit list, man? Who do you want? Uh, well, I mean, the big call out for me, I just heard that we signed uh, this guy, Kamsa Soren, who's the, uh, he's from like Turkey or Romania. He's a RXF heavyweight champion. I heard we just signed him. Yeah. That guy, he's the guy with like the, the infant on the side of his face growing from getting all (laughs) slapped up. Remember that? Yeah. It's like millions of views. It's that guy. He went like, I think he took like over 30 slaps in one night to get that title. Fucking ballistic. But I want that guy, bro. If you're watching, bro, you're, which you're probably not, I want you, brother. <laughs> and, if he's uh, from Turkey, so we're eating turkey on Thanksgiving Day. Let's go, bro. Let's Jeez. go, bro. I'm he, eating. He, I, 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 he, I like he couldn't understand you if he wanted yeah, to. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but, uh, you know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he, no, no. He, he going to look at you I, and be like, brother. Yeah. Brother. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't know I was talking say, to brother. him online. He, he, he was understanding what I was saying, so I don't know. We'll see. Oh, but, okay, uh, okay. Hey, Ain't nothing to Google Translate. I was say, bro, we, I mean? we on that Google Translate. You I, know what time it is. I did it, it in is. Brazil. It was nice. It was nice. It was okay. smooth. Okay. All right. I got to get hip to that then, man. I, I'm just like, <laughs> no, no Espanol, no, no Romanian, you know? Yeah. <laughs> what is, I'm not uh, from around here. It's okay. Yeah, hit that Translate. They think you smooth. Yo, I, 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 want, I, I want that guy. I want Darius the Destroyer because he's a legend. I want him before he retires. And or I would like the rematch with Dwayne, uh, Dwayne the Iron Giant because he's uh, ranked higher than me, I think, right now. So and how like so Dana White loves man. He's he's power slap. Obviously, this is like his baby, man. How how has your life changed being around Dana, being in the power slap? What's it what's it like, man? How how has it changed for you? 
just uh it, it's cool man it's uh it's cool to be around people like you know you dustin and t-rex you know cool to meet you and um you guys i've been watching on, on the ufc for a really long time i kind of missed the boat i was going to get into boxing and uh try to be like a legit pro boxer but uh, i had a, a couple of deaths in the family and it, it was kind of hard to get over and a lot of sh uh, shit just happened so uh pulling through though and getting this call my life has changed you know through and through uh, I, i'm happier you know uh there, there's new money coming in on the side you know i still have a full-time job but you know this is cool to have you know I, I work out all the time regardless um so you know one one girl said why do you work out so much what do you do it for you know you, you should join the military or something well now i'm in power slap so there you go if you're watching that's what i was doing yeah. it for yeah jokes on you trick i'll be yeah. slapping these hoes let's yeah. go i know i yeah. need a, i need the backhand league you know what i mean <laughs> what's next dude hey it's like a jab <laughs> ah. Ah. no you gotta <laughs> But but now you know I saw her at the Target. She was with a, a a guy that you know he was looking beta and she had a kid. She wasn't looking too happy. So I'm on the up and up, baby. Don't yeah, matter. you you won that, bro. You you won that. What do you what do you do outside? What's the full? You said you had a full time job. I I fucked up. We had we had uh, Vernon on and he's a mechanic. I called him the machine. We're way <laughs> on. Yeah, I, I fucked that up, bro. He's hey, he's he's good dude, man. Super you need solid the mechanic dude. Mechanic for the machine. To work. Uh, that's what I said, man. But machine mechanic, I no was no further question. Yeah, it was tough tough crowd that day. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, man. He, I was, it's just because he lost the screws, so he wasn't. You know, I know, man. man. I, I, I was excited, dude. Pitches. Me, we were vibing, bro. There was, there was good energy. We were going. We were slapping. Yeah. It was getting crazy. I said, "Let's go, let's go." The machine. Oh, I'm the mechanic. Uh, yeah. But what, what's, good, your, what's your full time job? Uh, my full time job. I'm a sales administrator for a, a company that sells like big industrial and medical equipment. Um, so it's a. You know, you be selling uh, them plastic dolls, G. <laughs> <laughs> Only on the weekends, brother. The yeah, big so. booty ones, huh? <laughs> the big booty ones, the BBLs. You know what I mean? That's it. But they get they get the high dollar. But uh, <laughs> nah, we, nah, we selling uh, we selling some pretty uh, pretty crazy technical shit stuff that we only sell, and uh, it's been pretty hectic with the, how the way the world is today. So, but uh, yeah, it's cool, man. Um, I do that. I golf. I, I do. Uh, Regular shit, man. Play video games. You know, kill the gym. You know, kill the ladies in the under the sheets. You know, we yeah. We doing it all. Uh, what what it, games you be playing? Uh, shoot, right now, uh, the Diablo Four has been getting okay, me good, okay. and uh, there's a new one called Remnant Two. I got my boys in, into, and we play it like you can have a squad of three and go uh, dungeon crawling and shit. Okay, so, yeah, that's sick. I like that. So for yeah. the ladies out there, because you be slapping. Yeah. Hey, so is it? <laughs> How's that slapping that ass though, boy? How you get on that though? That's what we want. That's what the ladies want to know. You know, twenty percent power. I'm not trying to hurt the man. You know, <laughs> little, we got, yeah. yeah. I'm trying to make her. Pepper. I'm trying to make her man see the handprints. You yeah. know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, the the man ain't there anymore after the white night with me. But so, um, but uh, yeah, you know, it's uh, the ladies are coming through sometimes. Uh, they're, they're, you know. <laughs> It is a thing. I one lady did just broke up with me a couple of weeks ago though because I was a slap fighter, which is kind of strange. I did thought. you slap her and let her know what time it was? <laughs> <laughs> bro, if I slapped this chick, I would have broke her in half, bro. So I, I wasn't trying to. She was a, a little like hundred pounder, you know. So uh, but, she just uh, being a player hater or what? What was the deal? Man, she she was like intimidated. She would text me. She's like, I'm. She's like, you must be aggressive, huh? That's what she said. Yes, huh? I, some well i don't know it, it was weird because like i was trying to be real cool she she was a dope girl you know what i mean like you could hang out with her she was kind of like you know you play a video game with her she was like you can go hiking with her and she didn't really care and then all of a sudden she's just like got into her own mind man and you know that was that i went camping with her and after the, the camping up? trip What's it was all done doing my podcast? <laughs> <laughs> what hey, he got hey what's oh. happening <laughs> i'm fucking five minutes late you bring in a different nigga <laughs> 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 i'll I, I tell you what hey he i'll tell you what enjoy this nigga for a little while and then my black ass will come hey, hey oh, what, what's up what's up kevin holland <laughs> <laughs> Yo, look, you know, I thought it was you for a second, man. You had a little dread work done, bro. I fucked up. <laughs> Kevin's got a new thing going, bro. He's going... I, I try to tell him. black people look alike, huh? They do, no. huh? <laughs> hey, just don't slap me, bro. We're you don't, you don't know just if it's my mom or something. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Coming up. Kevin, 
He's going. Kevin's going just shirts out, bro. He's yeah. uh, he said, "Fuck it, bro." His Zero shirts at home time high right on now. the pod. Summer, bro. I mean, hey, when you're a pimp, you're a pimp, bro. <laughs> bro, hey, hey, I've been doing 300 sit ups a day, fam. I'm in there. <laughs> you ain't doing it for nothing, bro. Take you that shirt off. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. tell Jack like, be ready. Tattoos and no shirts, baby. Yeah, just throw the fucking water bottle. <laughs> Curls for the girls. Know. Give me that fucking water bottle. Slap the I don't shit know why out, any man. of us are wearing shirts right now, bro. That's yeah. how it, how it should be. Can you slap and destroy a watermelon? I want to see it live. You got any fruit in there? Oh, no, I don't have any fruit. You got, got an apple or something? You got no fruit got, in there? I got broccoli. I got some carrots, but no fruit. Yeah, let me see you slap something. Got, I, you, I need to see you slap <laughs> something, gang. Eh? Yes. Now, the prize is Fuck, out of here, <laughs> Fuck you, Logan Paul. Fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> That's ninety percent Kool Aid. They made those with Kool Aid package. They can't trick me. Man, those things. I, I don't know about those, bro. They don't taste that <laughs> great, man. To me, I'm not. Yeah. I'm not trying to hate or nothing, but yeah, I don't know about those either, man. Yeah. That's why There's I got no the, way the, it's two percent sugar. You know, I got the, yeah. the real one next to me. If that two percent sugar, I'm I'm two percent white. Two percent sugar, my ass. <laughs> it's like ninety nine point nine percent. That makes yeah, me bro. like pucker up. I'm like, what the fuck? I swear. How, how did the fight end? Well, <laughs> yo, so how, what's it? Look, well, this is what I see about training regimen. You, you ever seen that movie Over the Top? Who saw that? Remember that? The <laughs> armor. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, it's like, yeah. bro, that, that dude. Yeah, the arm yeah. wrestling with the switch. Yeah. That dude had the weight stack in the fucking 18 wheeler, bro. Like, Hell is that yeah. what's the training regimen like on, on slapping? Um, well, I, I don't want to give too much of my own away because I got some secret techniques that I use, you know. So, uh, but for me, um, I, I really focus on shoulders, neck, um, the my jaw. I got the jawser size I put in and start. I bite down on it when I'm driving everywhere. People look at me crazy. Um, do that. Uh, you know, I put the weights on the neck, you know, do some curls, neck curls. And, uh, you know, I'm just pounding it out, bro. I got a, a bag with steel balls in it that I slap that it, it like, conditions Also known as my nut sack. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, Kevin's dancing behind us, behind Humping camera. Humping and shit, man. <laughs> I, 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 I knew it. Do you do, any, do you do any resistant bands? You should add that in there. Yeah, I do resistant bands. Uh, we do. Uh, we have a belt squat, and we throw resistant bands over our shoulders and stuff like that. It's like 700 pounds of pressure, like. Holy shit. On top of you and stuff, and you have to move around. It's okay. crazy. It's a full body All workout. Right, yeah, there's some there's some crazy shit that we do, man. So uh but stay tuned to my Instagram because I'm gonna be posting a lot of videos here now that I'm cleared. Hell yeah. And when we when we come out there uh uh for the next yeah. power slap, we gotta get some of the most outrageous yeah, we slaps. Gotta get some, shit. We gotta we gotta you gotta let me and Kev slap you. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, man. I, I think that's a hate crime. He's like, fuck. It's part of your training regimen, I heard. You got to be prepared. I think, you know, two slaps from a UFC fighter, you're ready for the championship. I mean, I, I'm down to take them, bro. We'll see what happens. I bet <laughs> my shit will be fucked up the next day. No, they better be that. <laughs> hey, yeah. I, I, see, I, ain't you, I ain't lying. I'll give them $5 if you let me slap the shit out. That'd be a funny video. <laughs> you heard that. You heard it here first. Sheesh. We'll talk. Kevin, we'll five talk. G's. Five G's. Five G's. G's. Kevin's like. On the pie. I get two slaps though. As, as, oh, as you know, I'm the cheap brother. I got 50 for you. 50 bucks. <laughs> Damn. Oh. What's up, T-Rex? My new bud. That's the come up though. I'll take that 5,000 bucks and 50 right on the side. <laughs> yeah. You can use that for the bed and, and, and then the 5,000 for the rent and the car. Shit. That's, that is a come up, bro. That's yeah. A, so, hey, are you going to Kev's fight on the 16th, man? You should come out. We'll all be out there. Where's, when's that? Where's that at? Vegas. Oh, it's in Vegas on yeah. September sixteenth. September sixteenth. You know how he he know how he does. He he got upset that he was only fighting every ninety three days, so he tried to get it down to sixty. He, <laughs> Kev, Man, Kev I, likes I, to break his own record. I mean, I'd like to go. I'd have to check and see if uh, the brass will let me go in there. That'd be sweet. Hell yeah. Yeah. Yeah, let us know, man. Well, we've got to wrap up, bro. It's been a pleasure. Let us know if you're going September 16th. Go check out my man. He's the hardest slapper in the fucking game. Put some respect on his name. We will see you hopefully October. What was it, 25th? October 25th, baby. Friday. 25th. Live let's go. Let's Ron, go. Bitch. King Phillips. All right, brother. Have a great weekend, man. Thanks for joining us. Yes, sir. See you, brothers. Peace. Later, bro. Later. All right, guys. So... Early morning card, 
early, early morning card this morning. I, I honestly didn't even go to sleep last night, right? Four o'clock in the morning rolls around. I just started watching the show Ballers. So I'm, I'm all into that shit now. Now I think I'm going to be the greatest manager in the world. Uh, <laughs> right next, you know, with Orrin right next to me, you know, we make a good, good partnership. Yeah, I see that. He'll be the gay one. I'll be the buff one. You know, like, like lethal weapon, yeah. It's gonna be fucking fire. I can fire, see bro. it. I can see that. I yeah. can see that. Yeah, yeah. It's like he's gonna be like every time I seal somebody, he's gonna be like, Shh, fucking put the whole thing in my mouth. Pause. All right. Uh, shout out to Blanchfield, bro. Motherfucker. Hey, has, what were you saying? You know, she's an incredible woman. That's not what he said. Wonder yeah, woman. Yeah, he quote said, unquote said that bitch got a motor. She got. Uh, I don't want to get beat up by her, man. I, you guys know my gas tank ain't the best. <laughs> man, she yeah. takes you to the second yeah. round. You're fucked. She's a machine. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I might throw up. Yeah. You know what I mean? Don't take her to the third round. Yeah. Fucking problem. So Blanchfield, fucking on a tear. I don't even know if she's ever even lost when the last time she did lose. Um, she's beat a former champ. But we're we're in a game where it's like you know you got to have a little bit of a popularity too, right? Yeah. Uh, and fucking, you know, it's like we know Rose has Thug Rose has a fight coming up, you know, uh, and she's what one twenty five weight class. It's a stacked weight class, right? So it's like trying to see what's gonna happen next in that weight class is a fun fun thought. But I really really would like to see Blanchfield get that push. Yeah, she you needs know? to. What's her record? Can we get some help over there? Phone a friend. I think it's twelve and one. Is it twelve and one or? Yeah, twelve and one. With all due respect, she deserves a title shot. S- Santos, whatever her name is, went arguably beat Valentina already. True, true. I forgot about and the, that. And the the way the fight was going to me, like I think she would have ended up finishing this girl. She she was slowing down round by round. I think she would have broke her mentally. But do you think Blanchfield stands a better chance against uh, Valentina or uh, I'm having a brain fart right now with my Mexican sister? Grasso. Grasso. Ooh. Um, I think uh, she has a better chance against Valentina. Grasso yeah. low-key got that, them hands with power, and she can she can throw them things on for five rounds straight if she had to. Yeah. And, Gra- and Grasso's not doing any spinnings or anything like no, that. No, she's like, none of that stuff is going to get her taken down. Yeah. She's, she's, she's sticking to the basics. She's making the basics look real good. But I, I like I like either fight. Yeah, you know, me it's too. Like, I like either fight. I like any fight for Blanchfield. I don't right think now. anyone... Can match her gas stink. No, and no. she has a chance to like be Like I said, that bitch got the motor. Right? She's super young. She got the motor. She got that Marab motor. Oh, my bad, bro. For real. For real. She's yeah. got that Marab motor, bro. And she got them J's we sent her for the last dub. So yeah, I just, she's I just stepped on your that's J's. All right. That's all right. You got the tuxedos on just so you just so anybody was looking out there. <laughs> my bad. Hey, my bro, bad. It's all good. But if you're going to step on tuxedos, step on them with off whites. Oh. <laughs> yeah. uh, T what do you wearing? I, we already talked about this. I'm, 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 I'm the cheap brother. You know what I mean? He's a company man. Respect, I'm the cheap dude. brother. Show everybody, show everybody what you're wearing. You're a company man. I'm comfortable. You know what I mean? So this fool had a whole skit no draws, about, about you know? complaining about the rock shoes, but uh, <laughs> yeah, I guess he likes the rock slides. So I, shout, I, shout I love, out to the rock and I, shout I, out to ballers. I that, love that the rock fire. slides. You can step in doodle and like. <laughs> These you, things were destroyed. Why are you stepping in doo doo? His son shit the bed. Yeah, no, no, no. Bed. Tell the truth. Tell the Wait, truth. My son bed? was wrestling in doo doo today. Ripped his diaper off. <laughs> ate some shit. <laughs> I was like, "What's what going on?" I was like, "I, I was that's, like, that's cousin Dustin." Yo, in him. get what? this guy. That's cousin Dustin in him. It's <laughs> cousin Dustin in him. I, I just start screaming, "Come get this baby!" The fuck did I do? And and now we're headed out of town. It was good <laughs> seeing him though. But and Turkey yeah, shit himself too. He got to go home. Bro, see, no, you gotta no, go bro. Home. see, Yo, see you guys, this kids there was something shit bro, going on here. It's it just gets, little poop butts. I never it, seen nothing like that. It's the it's a it's disgusting. And then you know the other day, and bro, I feel your pain. I told him I was like, you foul, <laughs> nasty. Connor comes downstairs, Dad, Kobe shit in his pants. I'm like, come on, bro. He goes, it's on the walls. I'm like, no. <laughs> no. Hey, so he, yeah, uh, yo. you know, in uh, Ready and Right, we'll get that right for you. Hey, bro. <laughs> You know it's bad when you get you get friendly fire and you next thing you know you're in the shower with them because you're like hey bro this is this is this it's is just bad. the best spot for both of us. Shit got deep, bro. Like you <laughs> know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shit got deep. Shit got but real deep. We didn't even announce it. We got the man. It's not a special guest. It's full time guest now. Yeah, T Rex, the brother. T Rex, one McKinney. of the blunt brothers on here in, in the house. What's up, baby face? Right here, you know. <laughs> We in here. Knucklehead Rex. Knucklehead Rex. On here, we don't even call him T-Rex. Call him Knucklehead Rex. (laughs) Go ahead and get on social media, and you're going to check in. Check in outside. That's what's going on. We outside. 
What were you saying? I was just saying, man, I, I think a little, a little spinoff too, maybe coming up, a little blunt bro spinoff. You know, uh, a little, little something, something here and there. Yeah, a little, little, a little pot in the air doesn't sound bad in this building. Yeah, you know, a little blunt, little blunt bros, little show too. Yeah, as long as you saw you guys can call me ones. Little Bill. That was also my nickname growing <laughs> up. You know what I mean? Knucklehead Rex over there. You <laughs> see what I'm saying, guys? <laughs> little Bill. Little Bill. <laughs> I used little to get in fights because of that, but you know, I what? think for, for the episode, called little Bill, little B, you know what I mean, little B, yeah, <laughs> little D. No, <laughs> come on, brother, you I'm are. You I'm seen how down. I walk? You know. You <laughs> see how I walk? That's only one reason. It needed space, brother. Come on. Oh shit! Oh, yeah. What do you call it? What I call it? Rex, because you know it Rex. <laughs> he says so quick. He goes Rex. It Rex him. Like this. I think I have, you know, stellar reviews. You know what I mean? What is it? What do you think you're? I think I'll be like a four point five. Four point five? Yeah. I think, I think, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna phone somebody. We both fucked. <laughs> <laughs> I don't Eskimo know what he's bros. talking about. Cause... She just blocked me. My bad. Oh. <laughs> I was just gonna. I mean, honestly, we haven't fucked the same person, but we have done mutual damage to the same person. That's what I, I'm I could saying. phone Rick. <laughs> wait, wait, so wait, let's wait. talk about whoa, Korean zombie. Whoa, whoa, let's talk about whoa, Korean whoa, zombie. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold it. Hey, what? Pause. <laughs> Rick, who's Rick? <laughs> don't guys, tell him. Don't be Rick, you guys. Don't tell him. <laughs> Please tell me Rick short for not Richard, and it's short for like Ricky, like a female Ricky Lake or something. I don't. I don't. Do you know any girls named Ricky? No, not really. But I was just hoping a shot in the dark. I know a girl named Ricky, and she's you don't want to know her, bro. Swamp donkey. She's she? beating people up, being belligerent. Might sister. steal twenty bucks off your table, you know. I mean, don't leave twenty don't, bucks. Don't on trust your table, any girls named fun. Ricky, you guys, or dudes for that matter. Anyway, you sure that's not a guy, bro? Listen, listen. I, I thought it we looked were just, like one. <laughs> I thought we were just talking about what lie. your Google rating is for Rex. We got down a rabbit hole, so we're gonna go to the next four point five stars out of ten for little little T Rex too. Uh, little B. Little B. <laughs> Anyways. It, this shit just got like extra gay today. It, it's got extra gay. But <laughs> I don't know how the fuck that happened. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. But he's. We're going zombie uh, in his career this morning. Yeah, that's before. kind of sad. Was good dude, man. I don't know, man. I liked how he fought. Um, he went out like a true gladiator. You know, he got he, up he, too quick. He, he, was he good. Looked, you know, he looked good this and fight. And I couldn't tell he was rock because you know his eyes was squinting or something. Ooh. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Who are you, Dustin Gutkowski? What is our loud ties? Look, see, I told you I wasn't the racist one. <laughs> yeah, you're not with the loud tie gang, baby. Bro, he said, because, yo, we're getting canceled. Hey, we're sure. jumping this fucker after <laughs> fucking. La two weeks These ago. fools are over here laughing. No, nah, we're yeah. jumping this fool after. What are you guys <laughs> laughing about? No, nah, but I love the Korean zombie. Don't sound like it. Like, I ain't gonna lie, I shed a tear. That's why I'm still wearing these glasses. I've been crying since 4 a.m. No, it's because you've been smoking that fucking reefer and your eyes are slanted. Yeah. I got a lazy eye right now. I can't even show the show the audience. That's why I have to wear these. Yeah. The hater blockers. I just want to thank you, though, because you pulled the race card from me officially. So I'm, the, all, all the <laughs> heat off me. Everyone yeah, knows. Black people are hard, it's hard for the most racist. Yeah, yeah hey. it's bad, bro. I, you're I, you're I, horrible. I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> that was actually funny, though. <laughs> That was funny. <laughs> I was like, Ref, I think he's fine. I don't condone this. <laughs> Shout out to all my people out there. <laughs> uh. So uh, congratulations will be T-Rex's first show and last show because we will be canceled. <laughs> I had a little bit to do with that, but it's all in fun, funny games. It was uh, funny, but Max Holloway looked freaking phenomenal. You guys are just going to shit on Korean Zombie like that, huh? No, I no. Think, no it's sad, no. man. He's he, I never dude. seen anyone rock Max Holloway, and he was able to do it multiple times. It was incredible. So you think he should retire? Even I mean, it's an emotional. Yeah, I think so. I think he should be done. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, because you, I mean, you don't want to lose to a low level. At least he left, lost to the be best guy. Last know two, I mean? last two guys he lost to were the best. Were the best he, guy yeah. in the world. He looked a little old in the uh, Volkanovski fight. I think he did actually look good. Uh, this fight, you know what I mean, you know, especially the first round, I thought he looked really good. The numbers were really close. Um, second round, Max was starting to do what Max does. Third round, I guess Korean came out there and said, "Fuck it," and uh, Zombie got zombied. But uh, overall, I thought it was pretty impressive for him to be going out and still throwing two punches. Yeah. I mean, you don't see most people do that. Most people That's go the out, zombie. They go out. Yeah, he went out. He was still throwing two shots. Yeah. You know, still has a lot of heart in him. Still has a lot Legend. of fight in him. But uh, smart thing to do right now probably is to hang it up. Yeah. And I, I, they built a PI out there not too long ago. And it's like, uh, I can see him being like the Forrest Griffin of that PI. Start you know teaching what I mean? and stuff. 
Well, just just running, running the whole thing, you know. Yeah, it's his PI pretty much, you know. Yeah, I mean, but Max, I mean, it's, it's not taking anything away from uh, Korean. I think you got to give more credit. I don't think Korean Zombie looked bad. He looked really good, right? Like he looked good. It wasn't anything he did wrong. It was just what Max Holloway did right. And I guess that's the tough part of the sport when you're watching the sport. Is it like, is it what? Korean zombie did wrong or is it what Max Holloway did right? Because it's tough, man. He's, like you said, he's fought two of the best ever in the game, right? Yeah. And so you lose to two of the best. Are you really that bad of a fighter or, you know, it's tough, man. I don't know. Yeah. It's, it's a, but you know, Max looked like a man on a mission. I don't know what's next for him, but man, dude look good. I, uh, I don't know what's next for him either. It's like, do we want to see him invoke fight again? You know, it's like, uh, no, not right now. You know, it's like, uh, probably not anytime soon either. It's like as good as Max is looking, Volk's looking fucking fantastic as well. Yeah, you know, and man. people, we gotta see the Tapuria fight. Yeah, the Ilya fight. We gotta see that next. So maybe Tapuria versus Max is a good fight. But if Max mm. beat him, then it, you know what I mean. Everyone, we gotta yeah. give, we gotta give the fans what they want. This is the entertainment business. Um, yeah, you got and a good then point. if the, if you know if he gets beat up, have Max and Arnold want it back one more time. Nah, fuck it. You know what I want to see? What I want to see Max versus Sugar. Sugar really? Time. Ooh. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, Dude, that'd be banging. fire. It's up a weight class for sugar. It's a fun striking fight. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so I think it's a good fight. Like you, 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 yeah, you, but I'm sorry, man. There's levels to this. Uh, yeah, but it Max's means, dog's on another level. This dude, yeah, Max has the best hands. The dog. No, he just has UFC, that dog but, in him, though. I'm saying, like, he, yeah. would, he would go to war. Yeah, Sean but, want to be clean. Once you make yeah, it a dirty true. fight, true. True. like Max does... It would not nah, I'm still good. sold on it though. I'll still I, like to see I, it. Why it's not? It's a good fight. Yeah. yeah. I like. Hey, I, I I didn't think O'Malley was gonna KO Sterling, and he did. Yeah. I mean, we're talking about that two guys. Look painful. Two guys. Well. We don't know what we're gonna do next. You know, and it's like. Uh, but either way, fun. Max. You know, I think he should. I think he's like a couple fights away from or Max versus Gaethje doing money fights. You know what I mean? Max versus Gaethje. It's, yeah. I think yeah. it's time fight. for him to start Max doing the Gaethje. money fights. Max Gaethje. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's Max a guy. He's Max a, Gage, yeah. BMF belt. Yeah, upper weight class. Yeah, round two. Max yeah. Connor too. Ooh. Yeah, that that's I, I like. That's Connor, can, can we just please? Can Connor get your shit together? I want to see Connor. Connor right, you right. know, for a couple mil, man, I'll pee for Come you, on, G. bro. You know what I mean? Yeah, whatever it takes. Whatever look, you look, I'll pee for you too. You just got to tell him you smoke a weed. Uh, <laughs> Terrence will you. do it. Terrence said he'd let you slap him for five k. That was a come up. Five k McGregor. Yeah, how are you gonna come up on my slap for fifty bucks? I'm going to pay all that money and you just go pay 50 bucks? <laughs> Fuck no. He's going to sneak one in. Hey, I want McGregor needs to get his shit together and let's see something. I want to see him fight. Fuck it. I don't even want to see him fight. Put McGregor in the power slaps, man. Dude. He slapped old man. He has no problem slapping anyone else. What if, what if, what if they just did Connor warm-up slaps? Like, Connor, if you yeah. can't get past Connor's Connor slap, slap, you can't slap. be in the competition. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, hey, did you just see, because uh, uh, I fucking love this dude, Mike Perry. Mike Perry's the backup fighter, which I think he's actually the fighter. Can we just say that Mike Perry's going to fight Logan Paul in the boxing match? You see, he's the backup fighter. I think that's safe to say. Right? But who's he supposed to fight? But I don't know. Kill? Dylan Dan is getting his money this time. Mm. Yeah, yeah, don't say yeah. that, man. We can't what? say that. We can't say the D word on here. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not from around here, so I don't get it. But we can't say the D word I learned last week. We give him no love. No love. Take back. <laughs> but who is, who is uh, Perry fighting? <laughs> he's fighting Darren Till? Is that who's on the car? Or are they boxing? Who? Mike Perry. Who's he on the? Is no, this was just trolling. Oh, were you trolling? I don't fucking know, bro. I saw He's the backup. He's the backup, but I thought he was actually fighting, too. I thought that's why he was No. There. I think Darren Silver is Mike Perry in a boxing match. It's pretty fun, actually. You wouldn't want to watch it? Yeah, I would watch it just for Co the entertainment. event. For the entertainment value. Co-main event. Darren Till lost gonna his be chain like somewhere, rounds. though, bro. And with the why? Come on, man. He is fighting Darren Till October. I thought I'm not crazy. Darren Till should just do Fuck. movies and stuff. Honestly, man, I was trolling you. Yeah, that's all right. No disrespect. Somebody needs to find his chin, and then he can fight again because he's lost it. No. So I mean, he's been like, sitting down like for a while, though. It might be a clip. If you guys again. really look at it, he was giving Driscus the hands in the second round. Who? Driscus. Who's that? Duplessy. Duplessy. Yeah. And then what yeah. happened? And then he got choked. Yeah. He gone. What I'm saying, he lasted long, long. But he'd probably do. That's what I'm saying. He'd do good in boxing. Yeah, not against Mike Perry though. Mike Perry hurt. Actually, that never mind, man. Darren Till for the win. 
Stop it. My, You're going against Mike Perry. Plus like 300. Plus 300. I mean, I, I, I for <laughs> sure. Mike Perry. Hit the lead. I got Mike Perry. I'm Mike Perry. Yeah, I got Mike Perry. Knockout. Well, I mean, Mike Perry, Mike Perry beat uh, Luke Rockhold. He's on that shit today, bro. Upset of the year. Yeah, I think, I think Mike Perry gets it done. He beat Luke Rockhold. He's a, a T Rex on that shit today. Mike Perry gets it done. I Mike told Perry you guys, you know. Hey, bro. Blunt Bros. <laughs> T Boogie said plus 300. Just shouting out. To <laughs> I'm available for the lazy eye right now, like I said. That's why I got to win. But I, I, I think Perry fighting Logan because the D word ain't going to show up, bro. Yeah. yeah he's out of there. Can we we got to give him a nickname, yeah? Neither one of them motherfuckers in box. Dickhead. <laughs> dickhead. I like Dickhead. Yeah. I like Dickhead. But that's probably the. That's that's the most. Well, the, probably the second most dick he's ever had in his life. I feel like he's had some dick, but yeah. I don't he listen. He searches I'm up Logan right every now, night. Listen. I bet you. No, no, no. I don't like that dude. I would box him straight up. Swear to God. I the security guard beat him. I'll put yeah, money he got, on you. He got dropped at a, a good point. I, plus two hundred. Plus, I just train with you guys. I'd be on some rocky shit, bro. I like move in here. Fucking, I'd be in it. No rules either, bro. We could buy now. Choke me out, jujitsu. I'm. I, hey, bro. So you can box him. Though. But yeah. boxing, I piece him up. I, I put money so. that. Listen, I think so. I, I piece him up straight up. We might have to you do a charity match so, against yeah. the against podcast it. guy. Yeah, I, bro. Hey, who does Brandon Shaw have? You versus on the podcast Derek to better. Him? I need that fight, bro. Any of the pod, hey, any of the podcast guys out there? You, you know, versus they don't Derek to better. I don't even know who that is, but he get it too. Pull up. No, no, no. I really got a good question for you guys, and this 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 last question I got. This last question I got because I was late today, so I'll take full advantage of that. Uh, like I said, full advantage of that. I don't know what that means, but yeah, we'll go with that. <laughs> So I know you guys had that Mark Zuckerberg versus uh, what's the other guys? Elon Musk, yeah. right? Elon Musk obviously is not trying to do it, but Mark seems to be ser very serious. Mark Zuckerberg versus Mario Lopez. He don't want that. Slater beat the shit out of him. You got Mario Lopez. Oh, Mario Lopez, up, bro. Listen, who you got? No, I want to see. I want to see. Uh, Man, who you got? <laughs> Plus three hundred. Let's go. What are the odds? <laughs> uh, Lopez. You got Lopez? Yeah. yeah. I got Lopez, too. Lopez all day. He's a real yeah. G. Yeah. He's really in it. Yeah. Everybody chose Lopez over... Lopez. Over. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, don't fuck my account off, bro. <laughs> Please don't. He, I don't think he... Yeah. Who y'all got? Lopez. Lopez? Lopez? Yeah. Lopez in it. Yeah. All right, Zuckerberg, just don't take the fucking fight, bro. At this <laughs> point in time, it's not looking good at all. I thought I had something going here. I'll, I wonder if they're close I want to the see way. him versus that dude that played Bane. Tom Hardy? Yeah. <laughs> See who? Uh, Mario Lopez? Mark Zuckerberg. Oh, uh, Mark Zuckerberg. Yeah. What the fuck? You want Facebook against Bane? The fuck is fuck did Facebook do to you? <laughs> yeah. He got blah, He got banned. He's on that 30-day ban right now. I'm, I'm sick of them putting a limit on the friend request. <laughs> he wasn't mad about that the other day. I was trying to send him some cards. What are they, they baller blocking I couldn't, I couldn't, yeah. he, he couldn't even send me the cards. I had to, like, unfollow people just to <laughs> add Kevin. That's, it was yeah. working. I felt bad, man. That was a good person that I was. <laughs> I guess I wasn't. Who working. was it? Do you remember? I don't know. If we saw, if I saw him in person, it's I would probably have Rick. Oh, dude. Yeah, it's probably Rick. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna be like, he's gonna go on there one day. I'm definitely gonna get in trouble like, for this Rick comment. Followed me. That's fucked up. How does that make you feel? You go on there, and somebody unfollowed you. Nah, that's rude, bro. <laughs> like Michael Chandler, we we're having for God over here. Michael Chandler, we're gonna get you back. I'm back on the mix, like on the team. I like Michael Chandler. You do? How much? Not that much. I'm not like y'all like Rick, but I like him. <laughs> no, Rick don't like us. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Well, <yeah. laughs> well, T-Rex probably unfollowed You want to know who Rick is? No, no, I really don't. Actually, it makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> I heard you. Because I'm sitting between y'all right now, and I'm like, I feel like an Oreo. Y'all talking about Rick. Like, <laughs> Slick dick Rick, baby. Man, I'm not gay. He sucked my dick. Whatever it takes, right? <laughs> On that note, this is episode 31. Yeah, uh, cut, the, cut, the, cut the tape. Yeah, I think we're going to have to call this one Hobophobe. <laughs> yeah, this, this we're getting canceled for this one. Definitely getting canceled for this one. Yeah, sorry, guys, in advance. Terrence's first and last show, like uh, Dustin said. Dustin's always busting. We got Baby D over here. Little B, see you guys later. I don't even feel comfortable calling myself Big Mouth at this point in time. Trouble. Yeah, that would be really homo. <laughs> <laughs> God.